Iowa House lawmakers passed a bill today increasing funding for the state's public schools. Chief political reporter Amanda Rooker is live at the state house for us tonight. Amanda, Republicans say this is another record investment, but Democrats say it's not enough. They do, Ben, and House Republicans want to increase public school funding by 3% next year. That would also increase the amount of money that the state sends to some students that qualify for a scholarship to pay for private school tuition. So a 3% funding increase means that public schools would get roughly $230 more for every student in their district. House Democrats say that increase does not keep up with inflation and will lead more schools to either raise property taxes or cut more services and staff. They point to school districts like Des Moines, West Des Moines and Ankeny that are already facing millions of dollars in budget cuts in smaller districts like Pella and Knoxville that also have a roughly million dollar deficit. But House Republicans say they're also working on separate bills that would increase teacher salaries, pay for paraeducators and support staff, and give more funding for school security. And they say taken together with the overall increase they passed today, schools will receive enough funding. We have consistently delivered steady increases in SSA to the tune of nearly a billion dollars in the last decade. Uh, this is my sixth year here. This is the sixth time that I get to vote for a sustainable increase in SSA, something I'm very proud of. How are rural schools going to keep the lights on? 134 schools have already closed. At what point do we stop and realize that we in the legislature are responsible for the shuttering of our schools? Democrats wanted a 6% increase, but their amendment was voted down today. Now, even though the House passed their own plan, the Senate has not decided how much they want to increase public school funding. Governor Kim Reynolds put out her thoughts. She wants a 2.5% increase. That is less than what the House passed today. Now, another thing here, lawmakers have missed their own deadline. They were supposed to make a decision on public school funding by last week. And that means schools that are currently trying to figure out their budget for next year don't know how much the state will send them funding for each student. Live from the State House, Amanda Rooker, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader.